you want to be a successful international hub, you have to have successful people want to be in a successful place. If you look at the successful financial hubs in the world, right, like London, New mm. York, um, Hong Kong, Singapore, or Dubai, mm. um, you will see that um, the country itself is doing well. I beg to differ that you cannot, it's difficult to ring fence because who is going to now come into this old city financial hub when they know the precarious situation the country has got itself into. So ultimately, though you are trying to ring fence it, it's very much, much a part of that country so currently the regulation has to change based on the economy mm. as you as you would say we would we have now had to make it a close economy mm. and tighten the regulation by central bank because of the economic situation Absolutely. right so there is now in order to be a hub you can't have no trade Absolutely. we are breaching all the wto rules we are not trade friendly our economic growth is now negative so in terms of ICT and technology growth, now it's going to take a back seat because we don't have in uh, we don't have investment, innovation. All these things are features of a uh, financial hub. Uh, so currently, I would say it's virtually impossible because we've closed our trade windows. We we can't uh, we can't import anything. We don't have liquidity. Absolutely. So any foreign investor coming into even the port city will look at how is this country the operating somehow in this country right though it's a, it's supposed to be ring fenced and but we are ultimately in the country is there liquidity for us to get out is there confidence is there political stability mm. especially in banking are there current account restrictions mm. you can't get money out to and fro from or are there capital restrictions mm. is there transparency in your financial mechanism exchange rate you say investor comes in he can't even book forward or he can't do anything Absolutely. because this is ad hoc decision making right it's all due to in all fairness it's not the financial services or the central bank it's due to the country situation Absolutely. then there has to be the human capital as you mentioned the the flexibility of um, sort of uh, the labor, labor force and uh, the legal aspects of labor mm. do we have diversity in labor do we have an international community absolutely. because if you want to be an international hub you have to have international people absolutely right yes. and if you want to be a successful international hub you have to have successful people want to be in a successful place mm.